back to my channel I will be sharing with you guys how we took out um, or how I took out most of the flooring I've never ever in my life taken flooring out this is how you do it when you don't know what you're doing when you don't have the tools that you need. Before you go anywhere, I would love it if you guys became part of the DIY family by subscribing to my channel and hitting that bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. On the topic of not knowing what to do and wanting to learn how to do stuff, today's video is sponsored by Skillshare. It's basically an online learning platform. So there's a ton of different topics that you can find in Skillshare and a lot of different classes. Whether you want to learn something for like your home business or you just want to get creative, there's actually one class on here that I will show you guys be more productive working from home and it looks like there's 17 lessons it's about 43 minutes long dress for success man first of all i'm literally wearing a bun every single day and i'm wearing a friday where are you t-shirt so i totally <laughs> need the lesson is a uh, dress for success because that's not happening here and you know I figure I work from home so why dress to impress but I guess there's something behind it I know you guys love home decor and DIYs into lifestyle and then there's crafts culinary gaming health and wellness home business languages da, 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 da. so let's just say you hit on crafts right you're gonna find a ton of related skills whether it's art DIY I know you guys are all about the DIY I'm gonna show you guys this one because um, you know I do a lot of home decor stuff so this one's pretty interesting style your space creative tips and techniques for interior design I think this one would be really cool for any of you guys that need help or tips on how to design your own space and this one has 30 lessons it's about an hour just remember you guys you're never too old you're never too young it's never too late to start learning something new the first thousand people to head on over there and click on that link will get two months of Skillshare for free I really encourage you guys to go down in the description click on that link and get your two months of free uh, Skillshare premiums let's go and demolish some floor all right so for this area this is what it looks like right now. There's not going to be much of a change except for the floor. Um, so if you guys can see, we just have, you know, carpet all around. Okay, so we have carpet that goes all through the living room to the dining area. And then we have this Milani shoe collection over here. She took everything out <laughs> for her baby. So anyways, we have this um, laminate that goes all the way around. So it goes all the way around and... When we got our washer and dryer installed, uh, they didn't hook it up right, so it leaked. And then um, this happened to the floor. So we have it going all the way into the hallway in the kitchen. And then over here where the dogs chill out. So all of that is gonna go away. Are you gonna go away? No, you isn't. Aren't you tired of the drama? You use your words like they are knives. Mm -hmm. I don't need that type of drama and trying to be tough for the daytime. So I don't know where my, bo my box cutter is. Do you think this will work? It's about the size of my finger. This is what happens when you need something and you can't find it. All right, so clearly I did not have all the tools um, that I needed to remove this flooring, which is completely fine. You gotta improvise when you, again, don't know what you're doing and don't have the tools to do it. So I did use that little pocket knife and it, you know what it was actually pretty easy I just cut like a slit into the carpet and then after that I just basically tore at it which was pretty satisfying and then I did use some pliers to just pull it out of the corners and the sides um one thing that I did do after I started doing this was put a mask on because the amount of dust and dirt that came out was disgusting and my mask actually eventually ripped so I didn't have another one you know I don't want to waste my mask in this time so yeah we just went ahead and took it out and luckily I have this big window right in this living room and I was just able to open it and just like throw the stuff out into the front which was kind of a pain because it sat there for a couple of weeks but anyways this is how you remove an old carpet when you don't know what you're doing but you gotta get it done anyways all right, so like I mentioned, this is going to come out in sections. It's just going to be easier that way for me to 
move all the stuff back. So now I'm gonna take this padding out and then also the carpet gripper that's going around. Try to make yourself feel better by taking me down. Once I fell, but now I'm strong, I'm ready for the rematch. So cold, get over yourself. Are you for real? Mm -hmm. Why are you looking at me so cold? One's love is nowhere in the knees. You try to make yourself feel better by taking me down. Once I fell, but now I'm strong. I'm ready for the rematch. minus this part I am gonna need help moving this ginormous thing so I still have a little strip right there which I don't think it should be a big deal we're just gonna kind of slide stuff this way um, as he works his way down we'll move it back um, but yeah we got all the other sides done over there I just slid everything back that way so again as the floor starts getting put down here um, so these I'm gonna move over there and then again slide that way so as he starts working this way then we'll start putting stuff over here um, you know so I also took out the laminate so you guys saw that there was a transition right here um, with the laminate and the carpet and you guys can see the line right there where it was so that's out and so I have it down this hallway right about there so I have this gate right here so Milani doesn't get in and then right there uh, so I feel like I don't know how long this is gonna take but I'm we're supposed to be doing this over two weekends so I think we're gonna do this side this weekend and then the other side of the house um, a different weekend all right so here is the floor sample that we got and then this is our flooring. So it's still a little, it's darker than um, what I thought, but I actually really, really like it. We were gonna go with a gray, um, but it just felt really flat. I don't know, I, did, I, I feel like this kinds of, kind of a, gives it character just because it does have like different shades. So it has like tan, you can see some gray in there. You can see a little bit of blue. I don't know, the lighting's kind of weird. Um, and actually on the camera, it looks a lot darker than it is in person. But I really like how it has these different sized panels to it. So it's one panel, but like each one has different sizes on there, which gives it just like a, you know, a different look than just the plain planks. Tell 
telling you I'm here to stay. But looking at your castle, I'm pretty sure you're safe, but still. All right, so the Alexa, turn off. All right, so we're starting the process of putting the floor down, and I myself am not going to be doing it just because um, I clearly do not have all these tools. If I didn't have the tools to take off uh, these little carpet grips or carpet grips or whatever they're called, I definitely don't have something like this. So um, yeah, the process has started anyways, and I think I'm really excited for this to finally be down. I wish I could be doing this as a DIY, but I honestly, since it's like pretty important to us, <laughs> I don't want to mess it up. For the most part, we're doing this to, um, you know, to have it ready for when we sell. And we do want to enjoy it, but at the same time, we want to make sure that it's done right so it doesn't give us issues when we do try to sell. So that's why we are not DIYing it. I'm walking in your garden What you're dreaming of Past the copper statues Of everyone you've ever loved Lower down the bridge and let me in Woo. You'll never get to know me
is going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Don't forget to check out Skillshare and then also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. If you do have any comments or questions, you know where to leave them. I will see you guys on the next one. Bye. Miss Trunchbull out.